so first of all we will open our shortcut application and then when it's open we will go to file and quickly open a new project we have this project screen and you can type in your name or you can leave totally up to you then we will add on the video on which you want to add an image so as you see our video has been loaded up over here so let us suppose that in between over here let us suppose after 10 seconds you want you can just either pause or you can wait first of all just add a video track and drag this video over here all right so uh, you want to overlap your image with the video so what you will do you will add another video track over here so you are able to see v1 and v2 there are two video tracks so now you will go and pick up your image i have my image over here i will just add my channel only so here is your image it is now running for the complete duration once you add it in your timeline so you're gonna add it and let us suppose i want it in the middle like i want it to start at 10th of the second and from 10th now i want it to be from 10th to let us suppose i want only it for five seconds i will just do it here but you don't want it on the complete screen so that's an issue we will i will just tell just click over here and press f button you will have to search for size and you will get size and position once you click size and position position you will get such arrows over here just click and resize your image You will be able to resize for position you can just either preset or here it is in the very center just uh, let us suppose if my video is in center and i want to tell something about it you want to add it like this uh, it's for five seconds size and position i have done i'm done with those and then now you can just drag the cursor over here and then click on play for the preview the preview might show a blur image because it's a preview not the final export let us wait for the five seconds all right it's about to come so here's our image for five seconds and go so here was it it's very simple just don't forget to add your image in a new track and add one filter over here so after this you can just simply click on export and you can don't change the settings wherever you want either timeline or source whichever you are having this is called source this is called timeline but it's fine it's working in sync for the both ways click on export file choose the location and just gonna type sample click on enter and boom your processing has started let us just wait Oh, it's doing fast because it's just a 20 seconds with you my friends so uh, oh cool done i will just open up in folder and here it is sample let us play the video all right so this is the video uh this is for independence day we were lighting up the sky lantern so we should get an image over here oh here it is our image it should stay for around a few seconds all right and it disappears so it was all about our tutorial about how to add your image to the videos through shortcut video editor thank you for watching do not forget to subscribe our channel